Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. Whew. Happy Thanksgiving to everybody that uh, celebrates it. I spent a lovely uh, time with my mom and my sister. Uh, we ended up watching a movie that we had not seen. It's new. Uh, it was a book. Uh, the title is Are You There, God? It's Me, Margaret. It's a great little family movie. Funny. It's just wholesome. So if you ever want to, you know, have a nice little family movie to watch, I recommend that one. It's a pretty good one. All right. So we've got round two of Kushala and Adam Warlock. I already got my five star Kushala, so was not looking to get uh, the six star just yet. She is pretty cool looking, though. Uh, and I like her just from what I've been playing with in the arena. You know, the uh, five star and the four star. I like her. I like how uh, the incinerate, her incinerate lasts a long time. So she looks pretty good. And from what I've heard, she is a good uh, counter for Maestro, who you can now get from completing and exploring the Necropolis. Seven star for um, exploring. Six star for completion. But she seems to be a good counter for him. So we'll see. Anyway, this is what I've done so far. Uh, as you can see, I've already finished the Summoner Trials. I ran, you know, six stars up to win streak five. And then I ran my seven stars. And that's where I stopped there. And then nothing here yet. Now, I'm about to go and uh, spend more time with the family in about 20 minutes or so. And I'm going to finish this up, and I'll probably do the rest of the uh, arena in the morning. Tomorrow, I have um, another uh, Dragon Arena event, but I may try to do it on the computer and we're going to look at those um, deals. I really want to see those deals. Uh, so we may do that uh, tomorrow. All right, let's take a look here at the leaderboards. 11 to 30%, cool, cool. Uh, 6 to 10, only because I think there was an arena wins. And so I ended up doing a little bit more trying to get that. All right, so zero, number one, Tesla. Okay. What car do you drive? Uh, let's see. Ooh. Veksha? Da? I probably mangled that name, but I like it still. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're good. Isma. Jamie. Hmm. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you, thank you. All right. Oh, man. I had to laugh. Uh, you guys will see it um, in one of the later war videos. I haven't finished. It. I just recorded it. But I, <laughs> I had the fight. OK, I was witted. He was down. He had like a sliver of health left and he fired a special and I wasn't paying quite attention. And he caught me. And, and that was it. I was like, no. Are you kidding me? Just that one and it's over with now? After all that I was doing, just this one. But I just had to laugh. Finished him off. Hopefully I won't uh, die any anymore. And it looks like we're in a good place. Uh, it looks like we're winning. So if everybody plays pretty well. But the fact that it's Thanksgiving and, you know, I was in a, a lazy mode, you know, pretty much all day. So we'll see. We'll see how we how we do. Um, but we do need to win this one and keep on winning to maintain our uh, Platinum 2 uh, status. Saitama, congratulations, man. All right. Let's see. What is that? Plebceratops? <laughs> okay. Spartan. 
This is Sparta. Gabriel, congratulations. Averload. Darkesis? Huh. What does that make me think about? Is that, that wasn't her name though. God of the, the spider God of the, um, the under, under, under dark, under, ah, I forgot. Um, but anyway, it's been a while since I, I read it. Um, but I don't know if that's her name or it was really close. Might be a T. Mad Cat. All right. Budokai? Or is it Borokai? MV player, cute. MVP player, cute, cute, cute. That means you'd better be doing well every time. Skeletor, you know, um, they had a, a remake. I saw two different remakes. The first one, I couldn't get through the first, uh, the first episode. In the first episode, He-Man and Skeletor were fighting like they always fought and everything. And then, bam, nobody knows what happened to them. They just disappeared. Then, following that, was some drama. Because now, for the first time, people are realizing that Prince Adam was He-Man. Like, the father didn't know. Mom started crying and was like, that's your son, you know? And... He was like, what? You know? And of course, um, what was it? Tila, she got real upset and just left. She was like, you didn't entrust me with this secret. I mean, it was a bunch of drama. And I'm like, this don't look like something I want to watch. No, sir. I liked He-Man. But this right here looked like He-Man, the soap opera. Then there was another one. I don't remember what, what that one was called. Um, but it was different, like Masters of the Universe, something like that, where it looks like they did things a little bit differently, where instead of he has the power, they all have the power. And so they um, share it. And each one has something. I like that one better. I still ain't watching it, but I like that one much better because it did not do that whole drama thing. It seemed more action, more like the He-Man that I grew up with. Cause that's really why I look at him. I want to, you know, kind of get nostalgic and, and remember when I was sitting at home, you know, in the living room, sitting there watching TV and he man with my friends and GI Joe comes on. And then later on there was She-Ra, you know? Oh yeah. But yeah, some of them are just messing up my childhood memories, adding all kind of stuff. And I'm just like, you know what? Y'all go ahead. So I, I kind of stopped uh, trying to watch those. But anyway. Oh, somebody already. He's ready. See, Kushala. He already got the name. All right. I wonder when he got that name. Did he get the name after they announced her? Or did he have it prior to that? Very curious. All right. Oh, the one. Okay. All right. Killerama. The thing about some of this is that... Oh, Pepe. Congratulations. Little Chillin. Congratulations. You know what? So I don't know some of them because they may have changed their name, but I'll like see somebody that's from an alliance that I used to be in, but I don't recognize the name. So I'm like, hmm. Now, Dipper Jones, that's a name I recognize. Uh, congratulations. That is not the alliance that we were in. So it looks like he left that alliance, which I do not, I'm not surprised. The only thing I was surprised with is that he stayed as long as he did. I left before he did. Uh, the Kiro, KT1, congratulations. Oh, and he's right over the sexiness. Yes. Yeah, this Kushala, she looking nice. She looking really nice. 
Bitter Steel. Why is that ringing a bell? Bitter Steel. Hmm. I'm not sure. But that is triggering something in my memory, and I can't remember why. Somebody leave a message, uh, leave a comment. Let me know. But that is triggering something. I probably have to look it up. Mindbender, and I already know about that one. Mazikin? Hmm. I don't know about that one. Dragon Rider, only I remember because I saw his name on the other one. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> Kate Bishop. Okay. Do it how you have to do it. Go Dark. 666. Okay. I was just watching something where it was a wild, wild story that had a very odd but happy ending it was very strange hey it's kevin congratulations but uh very quickly sister didn't know what happened to her her sister so she files like i don't know 20 years later something like that she files a missing persons report the family didn't. The mother and the father didn't. All right. Fintech, congratulations. So you're thinking, Baba Yaga, you're thinking, all right, this is your traditional crime, crime, uh, crime story where the mother and the father, you know, basically unalived her. And, you know, that's that. No, that's not it. So they interviewed them. They couldn't find anybody or anything. And uh, the Mandalorian, congratulations. And the parents said she ran away. She ran away from home. The father said something strange about, you know, the ma, the, you know, his wife saying he was possessed that night or something like that. Weird. And so, you know, the police are like, okay, they did it. They did it, you know. But they couldn't find a body. They brought in the dogs. The dogs went to one spot. They dug, 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 and found a shoe. And they're like, huh. But they never found a body. So they couldn't really do much of anything. And eventually, they had to close the case. Later, a routine traffic stop in another state. And they basically find someone who they believe is the missing girl. And they're like, no way, no way. You know, after all the evidence, because all the evidence was pointing to the parents. And they were like, no way. So they were like, okay. They talked to her and everything. She said, yes, that is who I am. And yes, I did run away from home, blah, blah, blah. They did a DNA test. And it came back. She was their daughter. And then they were trying to say, oh, maybe um, this is her, but there were a lot of um, weird gaps in her memory, you know? So maybe this wasn't really her. And the mother may have had a secret child so that this was actually her daughter, but one that nobody knew. And something else, they had no record of this girl when she was an adult. No credit cards, no schooling, nothing. Very interesting. If you guys are watching this, remind me to finish the story when I'm live tomorrow. Anyway, that is gonna do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Take care, hit the like button if you enjoyed it, leave a comment, let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.